Hello everyone, you are welcome to how to solve this very nice uh, algebra equation. x to the power 4 plus uh, 5x cubed minus 6x squared plus uh, 20x plus 16 is equal to 0. We need to find all possible values of x. So, let's start by dividing both sides by x squared. x to the power 4 divided by x squared plus 5x cubed divided by x squared minus 6x squared divided by x squared plus 20 times x divided by x squared plus 16 divided by x squared is equal to 0 divided by x squared. Now, this uh, x to the power 4 divided by x squared will become x squared plus this will become 5 times x minus this will become 6 plus this will become 20 over x plus uh, this 16 over x squared is equal to 0 divided by x squared is 0. Now, we combine the terms with x squared and we combine the terms with x. So, this will become x squared plus 16 over x squared plus 5 times x plus 20 over x minus 6 is equal to 0. Next, x squared plus 16 over x squared. From these two terms, 5x plus 20 over x, we can factor out plus 5. Plus 5 as common factor in bracket left x plus 4 over x minus 6 is equal to 0. Next, x squared plus this is 16 over x squared can be written as 4 over x whole squared plus 5 times x plus 4 over x minus 6 is equal to 0. Now, by using this uh, algebraic identity a squared plus uh, b squared is equal to a plus b whole squared minus 2ab. This uh, x squared plus uh, 4 over x squared will become x plus uh, 4 over x whole squared minus 2 times x times 4 over x plus uh, 5 times x plus uh, 4 over x minus 6 is equal to 0. Now, here we have same expression x plus 4 over x and here we have same expression x plus 4 over x. So, we suppose that let x plus 4 over x is equal to y. So, this equation will become y squared minus this x will be cancelled out with this x and 2 times 4 will become 8 plus 5 times y minus 6 is equal to 0. Next, y squared plus 5 times y this uh, negative 8 minus 6 will become negative 14 
is equal to 0. Now, this is a quadratic equation and is factorable. So, we write this y squared y squared and we split this plus 5y as plus 7 times y minus 2 times y minus 14 is equal to 0. From these two terms we can factor out y in bracket left y plus 7. From these two terms we can factor out negative 2 in bracket left y plus 7 is equal to 0. Now this expression y plus 7, this expression y plus 7 is a common factor. So we factor out this y plus 7 and uh, in bracket left uh, this y and this negative case. In bracket left uh, y minus 2 is equal to 0. From here either this expression y plus 7 is equal to 0 or this expression y minus 2 is equal to 0. From this equation we get the value of y is equal to negative 7. From this equation we get the value of y is equal to 2. Now recall that we have supposed we have supposed that uh, x plus uh, 4 over x is equal to y. We have supposed that uh, x plus uh, 4 over x is equal to y. So, when y is equal to negative 7, then this equation will become x plus uh, 4 over x is equal to negative 7. And if we multiply both sides by x, this implies that x squared plus 4 is equal to negative 7x. Now, we move this negative 7x to the left hand side, then this equation will become x squared plus 7x Now, this quadratic equation is not factorable, so we solve it by quadratic formula. According to quadratic formula, x is equal to negative 7 plus minus b squared, we write 7 squared minus 4 times in place of a, we write 1 times in place of c, we write 4 divided by negative 7 plus minus square root of this is 7 squared is 49 and negative 4 times 1 times 4 negative 16 divided by 2 times 1 2 next x is equal to negative 7 plus minus square root of 49 minus 16 33 divided by 2. This is the first and second value of x. So, for now we have uh, two solutions of this equation. Now, when y is equal to 2, then this equation will become x plus uh, 4 over x is equal to 2. And if we multiply both sides by x, this implies that uh, x squared plus uh, 4 is equal to 2x. We move this uh, 2x to the left hand side, then this will become x squared minus 2x plus uh, 4 is equal to 0. And this uh, quadratic equation is not factorable, so we solve it by quadratic formula. According to quadratic formula, x is equal to negative value of b negative 2 plus minus square root of 
in place of b squared we write negative 2 squared minus 4 times in place of a we write 1 times in place of c we write 4 divided by 2 times in place of a we write 1 next x is equal to negative times negative 2 will become 2 plus minus square root of this negative 2 squared is 4 negative 4 times 1 times 4 negative 16 divided by 2 times 1 2 x x is equal to 2 plus minus square root of this 4 minus 16 will become negative 12 divided by 2 x is equal to 2 plus minus this is square root of a negative 12 can be written as a square root of 4 times square root of 3 times square root of negative 1 divided by 2 x x is equal to 2 plus minus the square root of 4 is 2 times square root of 3 and this the square root of negative 1 is i divided by 2 so 2 1 time 2 1 time and 2 1 time so from here we get uh, other two values of x x3 and x4 is equal to 1 plus minus root 3 i so these are the four solutions of uh, this equation